Now, I've changed perspective, so we're now looking to the right. Now, the right of the perspective is making a righteous choice. Now, right choice is just for you. It's just a right choice. I'm not telling anyone how to make or live their fucking life. I don't give a shit what you do with your life. All I'm saying is, in life, it's not even about God or spirituality. It's about a humanitarian, compassion and empathic situation. Okay, forget fucking religion, forget fucking the I'm black, you're white, you're pink, I'm purple, I'm an alien, you're a fucking woman, I'm a man. I don't give a shit what you are. Do you have a heartbeat and do you bleed like me? Yes, that's that's our starting basis for fucking spirituality, okay? You breathe, I breathe, and we have a heartbeat. That makes us similar, okay? Similar, not the same. So if we're similar like this and we all bleed and have a heartbeat, now, you have to then make a conscious choice. These little things of the, the word of religion, they've all been man-madely fucked up and they've been twisted. The words have been twisted, like impossible, okay? Impossible, what does that mean? It spells I'm possible, so anything's possible, okay? So it's a spelling of you fucking, it's twisted. So, there's always double meanings and double-edged swords to everything in life. Like we're going to the right now of this reflection. I faced you forward, now we've turned to the righteous side. So the righteous thing will be to do is, is the word, very simple words are, treat thy neighbour as you would like to be treated. Love thyself. Treat others as you wish to be treated. These are very biblical, very simple teachings. This is not me going on about the Bible. I'm not saying Christian, Islam or any other fucking religion. This is just love, okay? That's what the religion we should all be living in is just love. Now, love can be painful and dirty, yes, but just to give love, this is me loving. When I shout at you and tell you, shut your fucking mouth and listen to me because I know what I'm talking about, that's actually a form of love because I care. Because I'm trying to say to you, look, you're going to fuck up your life royally and you're now going to have to live with the... Actions have consequences. Now, what action are you going to take that what today that will affect you in a year or two years or three years? Now, if I go and kill someone now, I could quite easily. I know a person I would like to kill very much with my bare hands today. Now, if I go and do that, that's going to have a consequence to my life, isn't it? That action will have a reaction. It's a pretty extreme action for a reaction. But just in general, anything you do, spill the milk, you've got to wipe it up. Anything. Pick your nose, what are you going to do with it? Flick it, eat it, put it in a tissue. I don't know, it's going to have a reaction. So the reactions are now what you're receiving. So if your life's a bit shit and you're feeling lonely and horrible and tormented and fucking abandoned, that's because you've made someone else feel like that. You are now being given what you have given out and received what we've received as people who've loved you. Okay, so enjoy, this is called karma. Give love, receive love. Motherfuckers, now you're getting to receive what you've given. Oh, it's not very pleasant, no, I know, because I've had it for 30 years. Enjoy yourself.